Hello friends, this question is from the test series number 1 and the subject name is control system and the topic name is time domain analysis and it's a 2 marks problem. <laughs> question says that for the control uh, closed loop system shown below uh, if the R input signal RT is 1 plus 2T which is a ramp signal then find out the steady state error ET. Right. So we have uh, this controls a system of second order the the open loop gain has uh, the open loop gain is of the second order and so we will have a GSHS it's a unity feedback system so GS GSHS will be 10 of s plus 1 upon s square upon s plus 2 right so if I will let's consider the error signal yes which will be a difference of input RS minus output this is CS okay so it will be RS minus GS RS upon 1 plus GS right the output of a feedback system the CS will be what GS upon 1 plus GS HS but H is turns out be to be 1 so it is GS upon 1 plus GS only right so now uh, just uh, solve this take LCM then you will get RS upon 1 plus GS this is your error signal yes right uh, and now RS the RS we know that because the RT in time domain the input signal is already given to us it is given that my RT is nothing but 1 plus 2T so let's take a Laplace transform so the Laplace transform with the constant is 1 by S and 2T is 2 by S square right so just put the value of the RS here so you will get it as or you can just take the LCM of this you will get is that s plus 2 upon s square this is your rs right so now the put the value of rs here in the system and put the value of gs here in the system right this is this is your gs put the value of gs and rs in the expression of the error signal es so put it will be s plus 2 upon s square plus 1 plus 10 s plus 1 upon s square s plus 2 right so just take the LCM just take the LCM and solve it you will get s plus 2 whole square upon s square plus 10 of s plus 1 right so my error function will be explain as above so now let's find out the steady state error so the steady state error is defined as limit s tending to 0 s times es right we already have the f expression for es so just put the expression for es put the expression of the es so it is s time limit s tending to 0 s es which is es is s plus 2 whole square s square plus 10 of s plus 1 put the s equal to 0 dissociate is clearly turns out as 0 right so the steady state error for this function is equal to 0 okay so anyhow uh, it is also a general fact that for a system for type 2 system for type 2 system that which we have here the step and uh, in case of a step and ramp inputs the, the error is always the steady state error is always zero right so because we have ramp input here in this case so that we have proved also so my error steady state error is equal to zero thank you